Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Edwin, also known as Solid Snicky. And today I'm going to talk to you guys about the Sleeper Stairs, which is part two of the Sleeper Sleeper Simulant questline. So first off, you want to go to Banshee if you've done yesterday's questline and stuff and things like that. Go to Banshee, you want to accept this quest. This will take you to a special version of the Saber 2 Strike. Now uh, I'm just showing you guys some of the questline, you know, you can read that there dialogue and stuff. I always find it very interesting. Anyways, so, you want to go to Earth, and you'll see part two of your quest, which is to go and fight the Fallen Saber. Now, it's all handy and dandy, the toughest part of the fight is actually the entrance, as always. Uh, it's actually a little bit more difficult, the enemies are level 42, it's like 280 light, it's, it's a whole thing. Um, if you can get in with a fire team, that's awesome, if you can't, you'll be paired up in matchmaking. Now, uh, just one thing to note, you want to play this part cautiously, you want to play most of the strike quite cautiously. And uh, just for the fact that these guys will actually tear you a new one. So just if you've got a Titan bubble, which I was very lucky to actually be partied up with one, um, it comes in super useful. Blessing of Light is amazing for this part. So you can get a Titan in here, or you are a Titan. Use a bubble. It'll be fine. Now, uh, the next part is, well, I actually wanted to show this part simply for the fact the loadout that you want to use if you're playing as a hunter, such as myself. You want to use your smoke bombs and use those to cloak your teammate that's going up to, uh, to get the orb. Now you see right here I've got a guy who's running up, he's going up to get it. I didn't actually realize that he had uh, puck it up until I uh, actually seen him running down. By this point uh, the exploders came down and uh, we were having a little bit of issues. One guy actually died but thankfully the uh, cloaking actually saved our ass. Which is quite lovely. Anyways, so we're going to move on to the next part. Now continuing on. The next difficult part is actually the Saber fight itself. Um, for part one, you just want to run over here and just sort of use these parts to your advantage. Once again, a bubble comes in super useful. Our Titan switched over to Weapons of Light, which was super amazing, because we could actually just like, go ham on uh, the Saber itself. Once again, I'm just showing you guys that cloaking comes in super useful, and it is very important that you play as a team. Uh, anyways, so if you uh, need to rotate, and don't be afraid to, because the Saber will actually rush you, you want to just run over to this other side over here, and... Uh, yeah, go ham on it again. Once again, you want to look out for exploders because these guys will uh, spawn in, go a little bit ham on you. It's a whole thing. And once again, if you get rushed by the saber or uh, once you've done enough damage, you want to rotate back over to where you were the first time and vice versa. If you need to move, just rotate to the other side. As you can see here, once again, showing you guys the importance of cloaking. Our team was about to wipe. Uh, thankfully, we didn't. Uh, it was quite lovely. Anyways, for the next part... After you've killed the saber, you'll get a nice little drop. Now, once again, I'll show you guys what this drop is, and you can have a little read. Once it loads, sort of. There we go. I'm very slow whenever it comes to these type of things. Have a quick read. It'll be fine. Anyways, once you've finished all of that, you want to return to the tower and go to Banshee, and you will collect your reward. Or, you might be able to collect your reward, so long as you don't have your heavy slot full, which I did. So, that was a thing. But anyway, guys, I hope this helped you along your journeys to get to Sleeper Simulant, one of Destiny's most curious and secretive exotics. Uh, and, of course, until next time. Once again, I've been Solid Snakey, also known as Edwin. I'll speak to you guys next time. Later, guys.